welcome along to the channel in a new video. Um, it's quite a windy day today, so I'm just trying to find a bit of a location out of the wind just to sort of tell you where I am. So I'm actually walking across the field to the location we're going to find today of um, Staverton Road Signal Box, which is on the Great Central Railway. Um, so the road you can hear in the background is the A425, which is the road from Staverton to Southam and the location of the signal box sat just to the north of the overroad bridge which is now demolished but the uh, walls still remain either side so we'll go and take a quick look at that as well while we're here so it's only a short video just to try and sort of have a look at the location where the signal box was um, and i'll put a picture up that i found off the internet um, to show you what the signal box looked like That's the road bridge there. You can just see through the bushes and that's the main road. So we're just actually in this area here where the location of signal box would have been. So this is the uh, really small bank of the Great Central. As you can see, there's evidence of bits of freight chucked off down the side of the bank. And that would have been looking across south towards Staverton's, uh, Staverton Viaduct. So somewhere, somewhere just behind us, get the camera to turn around. Is the rough location where the signal box was. Now it's a little bit overgrown. There's bits of brick and all sorts everywhere. It's probably a bit of the old bridge there. So I'd say we're pretty much there. So the signal box would have literally been roughly where that tree is on my left. And there is evidence of bits and pieces lying around. I mean that looks like like trunking for signalling. So the signal box itself would have um, stood on like stilts, like a platform to the back of it. Um, there's a lot of concrete lying about, whether that's anything to do with it, I don't know. Possibly. I mean, that could be anything to do with the, the trunking or the signalling. and get down the bank a little bit there's not much really here to see yeah what's that hiding down there that black box let's go and have a look well that is that is like a battery box for signaling so that's definitely railway related. Sorry about the uh, footage, I'm using my uh, my gimbal today. Soda cell. So this would have been used for for light signalling at some stage. That is definitely railway related. That's an old, uh, old battery box. 
as you can see on the floor here there's a lot of freight lying about actually before i leave this part just notice there's like several of these battery boxes hiding there's another two in there there's a third one there i think there's another one just in there and another one there so these battery boxes would have obviously operated the light signals um and obviously when they come to the end of their life they probably just got shoved down the bank but yeah that's a part of history for you so we're just uh sifting about her a little bit really just to see if there's any sort of remains i mean there's that lump of concrete there I'm not too sure if that played a part in the signal box or not. There's a lot of this concrete. There's a lot of bricks lying around too. They're probably part of the, the bridge when it was dismantled. All right, just gonna try and get the camera back around this way. I just spotted, move this branch out of the way. That's broken. Part of a telegraph insulator. So yeah, basically this would have been the location here, the signal box. Not really much else I can show you, but we're just gonna take a walk over to the bridge and I'll just show you that part of it. And then that's it, another little section done. Okay, we're just going to go to the road bridge now and just take a look, see what's left. Uh, on our way through. It's a matter of finding a gap. Not too sure what that is. So here we go, this is all we got left of Staverton Road. Try not to get myself run over. And that's the other side which I've just come from. So yeah, all we got left is the walls either side. Let's see if I can quickly cross over. That's your Staverton Road. Um, yeah, so from this video, we've not actually uh, seen much, but we're just trying to find the location of the signal box. Right, let's start heading back. See if we can get a bit of drone footage of the area.
video, something a little bit different on the hunt for a signal box. Um, not a lot remains, so we'll move on to the next stage. Um, we're going to start heading towards, I think we're going to go the other side of Lutterworth next. Um, that's one section I haven't really covered yet, so let's see how we got on with that one on the next video. Thanks for watching. Bye.